Hey everybody, welcome back to Dougie Fresh's Fun Facts, where I drop a little bit of knowledge on you and tell you three fun facts that you may or might not have heard of. So let's get started. Fun fact number one today, that koalas have the same fingerprints as humans. Humans, along with their closest relatives, chimps and gorillas, are pretty much the only animals with fingerprints. The only other is the koala, an adorable marsupial that is separated by us by 70 million years worth of evolution. And it's not that our fingerprints are roughly similar to koalas, they are really identical. A trained expert would even have trouble telling the difference between a human and a koala fingerprint, even with a microscope. You can see the difference between a human fingerprint and a koala fingerprint right here. While the two look quite similar in the larger view, it's even under the higher resolution of an electron microscope that they pretty much look indistinguishable. Now you may be asking, why do we even have fingerprints at all? Now both our ancestors and koalas may have evolved fingerprints because they climbed trees in the same way. So I guess not all crimes in Australia are committed by humans, even though they pull human-like fingerprints. Fun fact number two today, that two people were killed for unfriending somebody on Facebook. Police say that a Tennessee couple were shot dead in their home because they unfriended somebody from Facebook. The victims had recently unfriended a girl on Facebook. The girl's father and cousin shot both victims in the head and slit one of their throats. Unfortunately, it gets worse because apparently one of the victims was holding her baby while the men murdered her. According to the reports, they left the couple's eight-month-old baby alive. Sheriff Reese says the girl lives at home with her parents and is constantly on Facebook. Sheriff Reese said, we've had murders before, but nothing like this. This is completely senseless. No, 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 no. She let me do whatever I want to her. Yeah. <laughs> you unfriended me on Facebook? This is what you get. All right, now that he's gone. Fun fact number three. Before Manson's band was formed, him and his guitarist Twiggy had a side project called Satan on Fire. According to Manson, they were a fake Christian death metal band that played at nightclubs. Twiggy sang and Manson played lead bass. The premise was that we were a death metal band singing for Jesus. Manson said we wanted to infiltrate nightclubs and cause havoc. He also formed another side project called Mrs. Scabtree where Manson played drums and Twiggy was the lead vocalist dressed up like a black woman. Well, we never really got that far, but we got a song on the radio. It was called Mosh for Jesus. I'm pretty sure Marilyn Manson had a completely different job before he was in the band. He was on a kid's show. Thanks for tuning in to Dougie Fresh's Fun Facts. I'm Liz. If you'd like to subscribe, click here. Check out the links below for his Facebook. Give it a like. Hopefully, he'll be back next time. We're crutching. We're not rocking it hard. We're watching Dougie Fresh's Fun Facts. Check out our links down below.